the one thing that I want everybody to understand is that this gives you a picture month to month of what's working, what's not, and what the costs are. So now if we take all this information, I've also created yeah. what I call a quick look. Okay. Yeah. What this is, is this is just the most important numbers that I need. This, you look at this for five seconds and you know exactly how good or not the marketing and sales department's running. Just to be clear, basically what he's doing is he just, he just summarized, he's, he's adding up all the bottom line numbers for the entire month for all the different, um, the, the different uh, marketing sources. And that's right. what he's looking at. Exactly. I'm, I'm summarizing the results of the campaigns. Each month, yep. Each month. So in January, we hadn't made all these changes yet. 168 leads for 63 opportunities. 38% conversion rate, 40 was the goal. Doors, conversions, 37% was the conversion rate. Look at our costs, okay? Yeah. Guys, here's what I want you, if you're a property management company and you wondered what can be, what, what is possible, these are huge, just, just knowing these numbers that, that Kevin is showing you here is just pure, like, goodness. You're seeing here what the real cost per opportunity is in a real company that's a property management company. You fast forward four months, okay? I've done all this fine tuning. My number of leads have gone down. Yes, they have. But what's more important is my number of opportunities is only basically gone down about five to eight total. Yeah. All right. And look at the cost where it's come down in four months based on this exercise. Yeah. Okay. So Three. I was spending $25,000 a month on three cities to generate mm -hmm. 168 leads, 63 opportunities, and getting these results. Yeah. Four months later, I'm now spending, and I'm not stuttering, mm -hmm. about $4,000 a month, and I'm yeah. getting better numbers across the board. Yeah. For the company. That's it. I'm saving the That's company. $21,000 a month to its bottom line and still generating the same results, if not better results. But bottom line is, is anybody can do this. And this is what every, this is what every company that, that I'm working with does so that we can, so that you can identify, I don't care what you're doing to generate leads. I mean, even if it's not, if it's offline, it still needs to be put on this sheet so that you can identify the winners from the losers is the bottom line. So Kevin knows when anything's read here, exactly what to go and address. The right. problem is, is that you don't know what to address if you don't know the numbers. He knows exactly where to go. And sales is always saying that the leads aren't good enough. Marketing is always saying that the sales or that the leads are great, but the sales, you know, they're just not converting and, you know, they're just not good at, at selling. And right. so it's like this constant battle. And, um, and this helps you to really, you know, kind of separate things out and, and, and segregate things out. And I think it's what just this awesome. does is it eliminates that battle because yeah. the numbers don't lie. Yeah. If the goal is on the top of the spreadsheet and the goals are being met on one side and they're not being met on the other, then you know yeah. exactly what department you have to go to to, to fix the challenge. Yeah. If we were converting under the 35% and the conversion of the doors number under that, and we were only getting 30 leads a month, well then obviously that's a marketing challenge because yeah. the sales department is closing the opportunities we're getting, we're just not getting enough opportunities. But if we're yeah. getting 50 or 60 opportunities a month and they're only closing 10 doors a month, it's not a marketing problem, it's a sales problem. So this tells you what department you need to go to to fix the challenge. I just, I just want to point, point out a couple of things and we don't have much more time, but, but the, the website, I mean, look at all the, look at all the leads coming from the website. That, uh, that is like, that's, that's your, that's that long-term, you know, you guys have more reviews than any other company in the world. I've just got to point that out. I mean, and yeah. that's, that is what's generating that for all you guys that are questioning. Don't question anymore. Okay. There's yeah. your results because you've spent the time from the beginning to do, to, to do the local SEO and to do the reputation management marketing more than 40, 50% of your leads are still coming from organic. You know, if you have any questions, I would just, you know, post and comment below the video. Any questions you have, we'll respond within 24 hours. Um, and, you know, if you, Accelerate Marketing, if you have any questions for us, you can obviously call us. 
uh, go to our website. Um, you can just 619-304-5155. Any parting last minute, you know, tips or, or anything else that you want to share? What I've learned over the last five years and, and, and recently doing this exercise, if anybody asks you if you know your numbers and you say yes and you don't know these numbers, you don't know your <laughs> Exactly. Thank you, guys. If you have any questions, let us know. And uh, that's a wrap. Talk to you soon. <laughs>